Windows allows you to send quotes to your customers. The best way to create quotes is to first build out project templates. Project templates will allow you to easily generate quotes based on your product or service offerings. You can create a new project and turn it into a template or turn an existing one into a template. To turn the project into a template, go to your project's application and open the detail panel of the project. Check off set as template. In a second, the icon will change to indicate that the project is now a template. Now when creating a new project, you can select from template and utilize the template to build out new projects. As well, you can use the template to generate quotes. For the best results, be sure your project template is set up correctly, including the planned work hours of tasks, assignees, service types, and other properties. But you can always alter the project template as needed. Read more about project templates in our knowledge base and articles on the topic. Now let's create a quote based on the template we created. Go to Add in the top bar and select Quote. First, choose which customer you want to quote. Next, select how you want to calculate the quote. You can choose from a variety of rate structures here in the dropdown. For example, the customer org would be an hourly rate based on the selected customer, or a service type would be the hourly rate associated with the service type configured on each ticket or task. Let's pick service types. If you want to adjust the hourly rate of any structure you selected, you can also click the cog wheel here. Lastly, let's pick the project template to generate the quote based on. If you do not select a template, a blank quote will be generated. You can then build out a blank quote this way. If you check include items, the ticket or task names will appear on the quote and it will allow you to add details to the line items. Click save and we'll navigate to the draft quote. Here the task or ticket names appear in the details and we can edit if desired. The hours are based on the planned hours of the tickets or tasks. The groupings here are corresponded to your chosen rate structure, as well as the hourly rates here. It is possible to add tax, discount, or other line items if you choose. Once you are done making any changes to the quote, we can move it to the next step, which is putting our quote in the open status. Once in the open status, you will no longer be able to edit the quote. If you want to change any of the defaults, such as the expiration dates, we can do so from our administration settings before finalizing our quote. Go to Administration and then Financials. Add a memo to your customers under Quote Memo here. This will appear at the bottom of your quote. You can include instructions or other information. Quote Expiration determines how long the customer has to accept the quote. In the administration company preferences, you should also add your logo and address here. These will appear at the top of the quote. Let's head back to the quote and we can send the quote to our client. Before sending, be sure there is a billing contact set to your customer organization. You can access the billing contact information by clicking on the organization name here and tab to billing contact and enter the details of who will receive the quote. Send the quote and the contact will be emailed. You can see what it will look like from the preview button in the action menu here. The client can accept the quote directly from their email by clicking the accept button. When accepted, the quote will be changed into the accepted status. When it's time for project delivery, you can convert the quote into an invoice. A converted invoice goes through a normal invoicing flow, except that it cannot be edited or put back into the draft status. Like the quote, we can send the invoice to our billing contact by email. See our videos and articles on invoicing for more details on invoices. If you have any questions about quoting, check out our knowledge base or contact us via chat or at support at one Thank you.